All right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video for today. And this is a surprise, but a welcome one. This is Overwatch Anime Short. Anim make, a, make, a, make a full anime. What are you doing? Short is cool. Maybe, maybe they're testing the waters. Maybe they're testing the waters. Give it to any animated st studio that's of quality. Give it to Powerhouse Animations. They'll do it. You know, they'll do anything at this point. But... <laughs> Not in a bad way. They'll just they'll just do it because they're good. Anyway, so this is Overwatch anime short Genesis Part One Dawn. So the anime short series is called Genesis. This is Part One Dawn of Genesis. It's, it's a good, slightly confusing title, but whatever. Anyway, so it's not that confusing, but you know, whatever. Anyway, so let's get to it. Let's go. That makes me think if they're not going to do what I said, they're going to do it. So. There's other anime uh, shorts series out there. I don't even know what it's going to be about, honestly. Uh, I watched the trailer, too, and I still was like, I saw Torbjorn and Reinhardt. Yay! Like, when it comes to the lore of Overwatch, like, I I, I know there's a ton. It's just, like, rather it to tell me in, you know, the video game or at least these trailers. And some of them, sometimes they do. But for the most part, a lot of the lore is, like, in, like, comics or whatever i'm just like i'm not i just i'm not a comic guy i just i'm sorry like i did i did buy the comic collection for overwatch the first volume i think there's a second volume i have yet to read them i will read them eventually i just haven't uh, oh god yet so anyway I, I just rather them tell me at least in something like this so i'm glad this this exists so let's uh let's uh get to it let's go uh oh it's in 4k too i didn't realize 4k anime let's go three two one play and we get, I think it's a three-parter, right? So you good so far. I wonder what studio did this. Hey, hey. Little, literal overwatch. What's this? Units approaching. Grid point one nine Charlie. Oh. You can find it. You can find it. Get out of here, Sky. Get out of here. Ah! Uh, ah, this feels way more serious than most Overwatch things. Already, it felt, felt like a Call of Duty mission. War boss, Team Kems. They were soulless machines. Is that Ryan Hart? Is that just one of those soldiers? We were scared. Okay. I was scared. They were supposed to be the beginning of a new life. Oh no! But in that mm -hmm. moment, yeah, so. it felt like the end of humanity. Genesis. <clears throat> it should be more centered. Life before the war was. <laughs> Extraordinary. Anything was possible. We had implemented God programs. The next generation of artificial intelligence became omnipresent. They controlled most of our infrastructures like the food distribution systems in there? aimed at helping against famine, poverty. We were no longer defined no, 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 no. by our get hit. mistakes. Yeah. No. The AIs oh, okay. were saving us from yeah. them. I bet you, Skate, you're a messy. Artificial intelligence Wish was that existed. systems to make our lives better, but what was really exciting was combining it with robotics. You're a messy. Omnica Corp started building a new line of state-of-the-art robots. Onyx would eventually eliminate the need for humans to do all those I like that we're getting this. This is exactly what I wanted. Jobs. Nice of telling us about the deep war. That puts power at your fingertips. You just spilled in left on the ground? Come on. At least pick up the fucking glass. To put power in their hands. Come on now. Omnica Corp. Always looking to what's next. Society embraced it. <laughs> sure. We had the pedal to the metal. <laughs> but who was really paying attention to the road? Uh -huh. Look, Omnica kept making robots smarter and they made life easier and safer. And as you know, uh, this business is all about what's next. Hey, my dumb flower and hat. what was next 
was Mina. And in Tech Talk, Omnica Corps announced today that Dr. Mina Liao, the science prodigy and eminent visionary in robotics, will develop the next generation of Omnics. Omnica Corps has Is she the creator of uh, Echo? And, well, we're going to do better. Right. What I mean is, they've done great. We've done great. But it's time to reach for the stars. Who's that Frankly, voice? I had my doubts. Uh, Dr. Liao was a legend in her field, but we were asking her to push the limits of what many thought was already perfection. Is it weird to say, like, I think the anime looks really good from, like, far away with the Somebody character models? When it gets, or not character it. models, but the just characters? It wasn't science. It was arrogance. When it came down to the moment of truth, we had no idea what was about to happen. <laughs> Skynet. He didn't just activate. She was born. Yeah. Life yeah, 3D. Don't touch me. Do the predator handshake. Was possible. But it was all uh, about. Turn it off. <laughs> turn it off. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, when you make something sentient, like straight up sentient and, and smart, it uh, never uh, works out. Okay. Yeah. You can advertise that, huh? <laughs> That was pretty good. That was a pretty good first start or first part. Of, first, first part, first start, whatever. Aren't we also getting a new uh, animated shirt for Sojourn uh, this month sometime too? Oh, no, it's bad. <laughs> it's mid. Are you surprised? Oh, no, it's mid. People played it? I, I'll, I'll watch the cutscenes. <laughs> Death of a game. Oh, Overwatch 2. Is it dead? I'm sure it's not dead. I'm sure it's... I'm sure it's doing fine, but God, Overwatch Two had so much potential. I mean, it's just Overwatch One, except with enhancements, obviously. But I don't know. they shouldn't have called it Two. Like Two Point Oh would have probably been better than just straight up Two. You know what I mean? Um, uh, but that was a, that was a good job. I'm sure I, I like that quite a bit. Uh, it's just one of those things where uh, I don't know. I feel like the, it's a, it's very late to start adding story stuff to the game. <laughs> like, all this stuff, I mean, they've done this, so the shorts and stuff. That's where you get most of your lore is the shorts. But even that, like, and you, you get from the game, too, sometimes whenever characters talk. But, like, that, I don't, I, I still don't think that's enough if, if you want to have story content in your game, cool. But that's not enough to... You know what I mean? Like, like the dialogue between characters in a in a the wait room before you start a game, I don't think is enough to say you have a plot going in the background. You know, you know what I mean? Like, it, it's cool to reference that stuff, but if there was also a story mode that was attached to Overwatch, um, then it would be nice to have like little character interactions in multiplayer that reference stuff there or even stuff in these anime cutscenes or uh animated uh shorts and stuff which there is references it's just like i don't know i don't know i don't know it's just not enough at least for me i'm sorry i'm uh, i mean get, to be fair the fucking overwatch has been around since 2016 it's been seven years Longer than that, too, if you count, like, betas and shit. So, like, but still, you know, you shouldn't really count those. Um, it's been seven years. You know? Last, two months ago was seven years ago. So, two two months and seven years ago, Overwatch uh, launched. I don't know. I mean, we're finally getting story content. We, we get little increment things, but this, this is supposed to be legit story stuff, and I'm hearing it's mid. That's great. <laughs> Maybe the cutscenes will be good. I don't know. Maybe that's what they mean by mid. Like, you know. Anyway, that's it. Uh, it's a good short, though. That was a good first part. So uh, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.